I've been expecting you, Duvali. And Class 7. She's wearing her helmet. My lord, why do you cover your face? The one who stands before you now is not Leanne Sandlot. Instead, it is the seventh anguish of Ouroboros, the faceless awakener of the Argent Knight. I welcome you as a fellow challenger in the rivalry. You seek to face us as simply another awakener. So that's what you've decided. My lord. We learned about your past in the Lunar Shrine. You died 250 years ago in the War of the Lions, but rose as an immortal. You found out about the curse that plagued Emperor Dreykels and waited two centuries for his reincarnation. You've experienced so many things throughout your life. You know what true evil looks like. So why did you join Ouroboros 20 years ago? Why are you helping them destroy the world? The truth is simpler than you may think. To put it frankly, it's all because of my pride, my regret, and something in my heart I could not throw away. <laughs> I don't understand. In his later years, Dreykels told me of the darkness which had been eating away at him. It started tormenting him after the War of the Lions, causing him decades of anguish. He feared it would never leave him, that it would haunt his soul for all eternity. I searched for his reincarnation to ensure his fears would not come to pass. And eventually, I found him. He was already a well-respected man with a high position in the military, he had a wife and child. I observed him for some time, and was relieved to see no trace of that sinister darkness. At about this time, I received an invitation from Ouroboros' leader. Though I had no intention of joining the society, I went to hear them out. It was there that I was told of an imminent catastrophe that would befall the world. It seemed no sooner had I breathed a sigh of relief, reassured that my fears were unfounded, than that vile darkness emerged anew. I attempted to intervene, but by the time I arrived, it was far too late. That's when I made my decision. I would join Ouroboros as an Anguis and aid them with the Phantasmal Blaze plan. I would take part in the rivalries and defeat the other five candidates, absorbing their power. All so that I might destroy the root of all evil, Ishmelga! <sighs> My lord... Whoa... What incredible resolve! Why did you not tell me? Roselia... How could I just sit and watch from afar? Leanne... Why... Why did you not confide in me? You and Dreykels both! If he was suffering under a curse, he should have come to me! He said to me it was something we humans had brought upon ourselves. Were we to continue to foist our problems onto you, we would only be repeating the mistakes humanity made with the Septarians. That, and he claimed it would not be very becoming for an old, stubborn man like him to go begging for help. <laughs> the mistakes humanity made. Like what happened in Liberal. The Septarian there, it... As for me, this all came about because of my own stubbornness. How could I possibly take such a selfish burden and place its weight on the shoulders of my dear friend? <laughs> Both of you are such hopeless fools. No, I am the foolish one for not realizing what you struggled with. 
Roselia. Now I understand. Your actions were motivated by loyalty to the one you love. No. You sacrificed yourself to protect the future of the entire Empire. I see now that you never truly sought to bring about the Great Twilight. You simply pretended to go along with it for the sake of your true goal. Win all the rivalries, and destroy the Ebon Knight. Oh. That's... <laughs> what makes you certain my motives were so noble, Duvali? Because I know, deep in my heart, in the eight years I've fought by your side, I've witnessed your sense of justice and your boundless compassion. You value kindness and living one's life with honor more than anything else. There's no way someone as virtuous as you would ever want to end the world. Regret? Pride? I'm sure those feelings were part of your decision. But your compassion far outweighs those. And knowing you like I do, compassion may not be a strong enough word. That said, my lord, if I may speak plainly, you have made a serious mistake. The Great Twilight involves all of us. You were wrong to think you needed to bear that burden alone. You have me, Ines and Inea, and not just us. Everyone here, Schwarzer, Class Seven, all of Thor's is working toward that same goal. <sighs> Duvali. <sighs> Duvali, that was... She's right. I'm with Duvali on this one. Uh. Her helmet! It's been eight years since I took you in. I knew a day like this might come eventually. But I never thought I would see those eyes of yours so filled with resolve. My lord! But do you have the strength to match that resolve? Whoa. I appreciate your candor. But I shall speak plainly as well. You have no idea the true horror you face. The twisted darkness of the Ebon Knight and its thousand-year curse. The snake that devours the world has begun to stir, and the Great Twilight nears its zenith. There is no time. The situation is dire. My lord! The shrine is resonating with her! <laughs> that can't be good. Instructor, what should we do? Schwarzer! It's simple. We just have to show her we have the strength to match our resolve. And that we'll be the ones who reach the Ebon Knight. Oh! His power! Huh. We need to put everything on the line here. If we don't fight like our lives depend on it, we'll never make it to the end of the rivalries. The Maiden's shown us her determination. The willpower that's kept her going for centuries. So we need to show her that we can match that resolve. <sighs> yes, you're exactly right. My lord, not only did you show me boundless compassion, you also taught me that power without justice is meaningless. Words will do us no more good. So I will use my sword to prove it to you. I'll show you that you were mistaken to walk that solitary path, and that I am truly worthy of walking beside you. Well said. <laughs> Not bad, Duvali. I got your back. We'll show you what we got! Very well. Then ready your blade, Duvali the Swift. Rose! 
mine. I, Crimson Rosalia, shall oversee this battle. May each of you put all your strength into it. Right! This will be your end. Fight with all you have. My mind is clear. My blade empty. Now! Ha! Ash and slash! Shred it leaves! Behold! The soul of our shade! Now!
You have done well to make it this far. My mind is clear. My blade empty. Now! Ha! Ash and slash! Shredded lead!
leave this to me. If you would. Watch and learn. All right. Let's do this. Fleet of darkness, cleave my foes. See you in Gehenna. Four foes, Slayer. Survive this. Ah! I am steel, she who cuts through all. This is your end. Red Cross. Sorry, everyone. Eh? Thanks. Thanks. It's my turn. You got this. I'll take over. Ignite! Crimson Lotus Formation! Let's go! Behold, the soul of our Sade! Now! I swear upon my sword, evil will not prevail. I did it. <gasps> we did it. Don't be so hasty. We've only just begun. We won't lose to you. My lord! Looks like it's time for the main event. Let's begin, Argreon. Understood. Hmm. 
My lord. We'll take it from here, Duvali. I swear we'll get through to her for you. <sighs> All right, Schwarzer. Don't you dare disrespect my lord with some half-hearted display. <laughs> you got it. Good luck. Leanne has been piloting that knight for 250 years. Do not take her lightly. Heed my call. Valimar! Come, Ordeen! I have not had the chance to battle other Divine Knights since our meeting at the workshop. That sword of yours, I can sense that girl's presence within. Yes. Although we can't hear her or Valimar's voices now, we know they're always with us. For their sake, we can't afford to lose now! You ready, Steel Maiden? We're gonna go full force. I admire that spirit. I will not hold back either. Bring to bear all the strength you use to best the Jaeger King! My turn! Not enough! All right! There! You're wide open! An opening! <laughs> you 
You've grown considerably. There! <laughs> An opening! Will you survive this? My turn! Darkness, 
under them! I'm up! It's my turn! Tough! <clears throat> now! An opening! <clears throat> This bites. There! Let's do it, Rain! Got it! Keep going for a brighter tomorrow. <laughs> 